Hey, welcome to Adventure Roads. Um, you're going to be seeing our, our camper video today. And actually, the reason why we're putting this on there is because we're going to put it on our Facebook page too. Because we're going to try to sell it. So, um, it says a Jayco 21 QB. It's a 2018. It has literally only been from the... We got at TCRV in Traverse City and towed it out here to the property. And I think we've towed it into Kalkaska a couple times, two or three times to uh, dump the tank. So it has less than 200 miles on the uh, tires. And so it's in excellent shape. It's like brand new. We really haven't used it a lot, um, but we just figure at this stage, we're probably with what we got going on with kids and stuff and our schedules right now is probably the time to go ahead and sell this. So anyway, it's, uh, um, it's a Jayco 21 QB. It's got power awning, LED lights up on the uh, awning. Uh, steps all fold up. Tires are in excellent shape. We have some uh, um, tire covers for this as well, the uh, gray ones. Um, we just have them off for the uh, video. And then we also have, it's got uh, storage that goes all the way through the front here. So we got wheel wheel chocks, more blocks, hoses, everything. And that all comes with that'll it. That'll all come with it. Um, I've towed it with the uh, F-150. Um, it tows, tows fine. Um, and let's see, it's got two uh, 20 pound propane tanks. Yep. got the uh, power jack to go up and down it's got a light on the front that's kind of handy um, and on this side it's this is the extension of the storage it's got latches to hold these up while you're in there and it's coming with the hose too right yep coming that's with an hose. rv hose specific for water rv hose we even have a brand new uh water filter for it that'll go with it we like camping we we're just our schedule right now it just feels we like we love camping and we got it mainly when we did our airbnb and when we bought the property when we were transitioning into stuff and we thought we'd try the trailer a little bit um truthfully for us we're probably more truck campers that's probably what we'd like to get next is eventually the truck camping at mm -hmm. some point in time but this is really nice it's got outside shower which Every, is it's, great it's all winterized right now so we're not going to be running the water right now Probably pretty soon they're talking um, possible snow again coming up. So we're not going to be running the water right now. So here's the outside <laughs> yep, shower. Yep, really nice. Um, let's see here. There's. Oh, city water connection. <laughs> there's a there's the city water connection. Tank, tank flush. Um, you gotta watch the movie RV. You wanna uh, flush your turds. So. <laughs> really? Um, for water. There's. This is for uh, portable water. This holds, I believe, it's like 80 gallons of water. Yeah, it is 80 gallons. It, um, so that was one of our uh, reasons we liked it. Holds a lot of water. So if you're parked in place for a while, obviously, I wouldn't recommend towing 80 gallons of water. That's a lot of weight. But um, anyways, and then. Uh, there's the uh, furnace and all that hot water heater. Mm-hmm. Looks good. And we will go inside. Show you the inside. It's windy, so we're gonna show you the awning coming out, and then we'll put it back in because you don't want to leave the awning out when it's too windy. It's a really nice awning, all powered. This thing has not been to a campground. This thing has not been to a campground, but you can see the wind pushing on it. Also, this has an exterior propane um, extension right here, so you can hook up a outside grill. And if you're interested, uh, look at the link below. I'll have the actual specs for the 2018 Jayco 21 QB in the link below. Okay, so there's LED lights. See them? Okay, and then there's also speakers. Speakers for the outside. 
Speakers for the outside, the inside, or both. As you can hear the music coming out. They get pretty loud too. This is inside speakers, so it has dual, you can cha change it to just outside or inside as a DVD, CD player, there's the TV. Um, it'll also Bluetooth with your phone, if you got music on your phone, you can sync it with your phone, play the music off your phone. Um, it has antenna. Um, this is the uh, wireless. It has a television, you can hook up movies to it, you yep. can watch TV. And... This is the uh, dinette seating area. We'll pop this up here in just a minute. And this is the uh, couch here. It's got three awesome windows. Um, this is partly why we parked it out here at the ranch because you got good views all the way around. It's a view out the back and then the uh, side. And this couch pulls up. It has the uh, hot water uh, bypass and all that stuff underneath here. You can pull this out lays flat to be a uh, sleeping area probably for a kid or small person pretty easy there and then we will pick this up it's got two storage cabinets underneath with uh, totes it's got storage above storage above the couch here a lot of storage lots of storage and it has storage over here too. And here's the refrigerator area. Storage here. Storage here. This is your uh looks like we're just box panels. Looks like we're just living on pasta. Living on what? Pasta. That's yes. all there was Elbow there. macaroni. <laughs> I always well, like that word. That's a funny word. So freezer. I believe this is a five cubic foot fridge freezer. So separate freezer. Enough. I like a big fridge. Fridge. Yep. Holds quite a bit of stuff. Um, your furnace, it's got, uh, here's, uh, right now it's off. This is low, which will turn on the air conditioner. That's the air conditioner turning on. You can set on automatic. Here's like 66 degrees. We're on M66, so how fitting. Um, you can turn it to whatever, uh, high. What's the other modes, Josh? And there's, uh. There's cool, here's furnace. furnace. Okay, we're good. There's a furnace. The table's popped up. The table is popped up. You can fold it down for transport or pick it back up. It takes a little bit of move, maneuvering, but you get kind of used to it, so not too bad. It's cozy, right it fits four really well. Fits four pretty comfortably. And you can set one or two at the ends here. Yep. Um, more storage up there, storage and storage. Microwave. A pretty good microwave. Uh, gas stove. Gas stove. And oven, nice. And oven. Yep. Nice um, sink. Nice sink with the uh, pull up door as well. Two sides, pretty deep sinks. Yep. Storage above. Storage above. A lot of lights in here. So there's the light switch area. This is where you can turn the hot water on and the hot hot yeah, water off from the water pump. Yeah. And as you can see, the lights are, plugs. lights are coming on. There's lots of plugs, lots of lights. Similar drawer. Drawers of things. Underneath storage. Yep. It's pretty fancy. It's got nice shades that pull down and push back up. Um, it's on all three of these. It's pretty black. Uh, the last windows. Green, you can even. Hey, pass me a drink, Bob. So there you go. Nice pass through window. All right. Bathroom area. Nice uh, porcelain toilet. Real glass, porcelain, and nice sink, medicine cabinet. Um, there's a fan here. Also, a uh, screen opens up. And oh, right here. 
there is the vent. So if somebody drops a bomb, you can air that out. Let's see. Nice uh, bath and shower. Stand up and take a shower. Skylight. Holds 80 gallons of water, so it runs quite a while. The bedroom area, you can walk all the way around, queen bed, and so it makes it a little bit easier for making bed. Um, storage on each side with a clothes hanging rack. Uh, all the way, you got storage all the way through in between these cabinets as uh, top of the bedroom. Uh, reading lights, push on and off. Um, it's got AC, there's a vent right there. Um, you have a plug-in up here and there's also a cable thing. I don't know if that's for if you want to hook up a TV on this end or not. But you can see the TV from the bed here. We've watched a couple movies out here like that. Also it has storage underneath the bed which you can get to underneath the camper. So that just folds right up and there's all your storage underneath the bed. Also has privacy curtain. Uh, phone chargers uh, right here on the side of the bed, plug-ins, reading lamps, and windows on each side that open like the back. And you can pass through as well or just leave the screen shut. Thanks for watching Adventure Roads on YouTube and our Jayco camper. It's been a nice camper. We just haven't used it a lot, hardly at all, really. Uh, 2018, we are asking 16 or best. And if you're interested in taking a look at it, my number is 231-384-0205. And uh, anyways, uh, we're uh, Kalkaska, Michigan, Fife Lake, Michigan. Uh, so if you're interested, give us a uh, call. Our next video coming out will be uh, over the river and through the woods.